So it's the 17th of December, back up at Ladybow, I don't really see the bridge over there. Uh, instead of going around Ladybow, I'm going to go up, I don't know if you can see that, up Crook Hill. Uh, along the tree line, basically make my way towards the end, into Elk Valley. Uh, it's a bit breezy, so uh, there'll be a bit of wind noise, I'm afraid. So I've just gone over Lady Bower Bridge. <laughs> Got the uh, Derwent to me right here. Just a few hundred metres up this way. There's a left turn that takes you up onto the tops. A steep climb, short and sharp. Yeah, this is where turn off. So this is Crockhill Farm. I think I'm sheltered by the wind a bit here. Once I get up top, so it'll be pretty bad. I don't know what GoPro's showing, but along that ridge there, went along there during the summer. So it's kind of muddy, I wish I had lower gears. How I've got it set up, the lowest gear I've got is a, uh, what is it, 32 at front, 36 at back. Uh, I'm a victim of circumstance. The derailleur won't go any higher, and I've changed up to group set out. I didn't want to spend too much. But uh, I did need to change all the cogs and stuff, chain ring, on shorter, shorter crank on it as well. Uh, getting quite expensive, so I couldn't be bothered for another well to get. I would like the uh, new Dior, uh, which can go up to I think 46, is it? Uh, but just ain't got the money. No point changing something that's not broken. I really need lower gears, especially when you come up here with slippy mud and everything. I have got a new back tyre on as well, that uh, is helping a bit. Nice to have a bit of tread. The other one was virtually bald. So I made it to the top. Look at over there's Bamford and Stanage Edge. Well, Bamford, Stanage Edge. Chrome Hill, Wynn Hill, Lucille and Ram Tour, if you can hear me. Uh, oh, there's Kids Scout. Right. Yeah, so I'm going down a little bit. It's going to be a bit flat now. It is windy. Reminds me when I did the walk to Alport Castle. A bit like this. Heading towards back up the crossroads, actually farm crossroads. Switch back on when I get up there. So I don't know what you can see. I don't know because you're mounted on my chest. I don't know what you can see, but that uh, hill there, uh, halfway down, there's like a cutting. That's the path I'm going to be taking. So because of wind, I don't know what you can hear. Uh, but I'm at to the crossroads. Well, what I call the crossroads, Hag Farm crossroads get through the gate down there but I just find it easy just to keep lift it over this uh, style. It's a bit muddy down there. Actually, it's a bit muddy here as well for that matter. hard left here, it takes me down to Hag Farm. Just take a soft left, so it goes 
up that way, up that way. Uh, it takes me down, still takes me down to Snake Pass. If I go up and then just left, it takes me to Teleport Castle. Um, if I just keep going straight on, it takes me back down to uh, Lady Bower, or at least uh, Derwent Reservoir. So, uh, Going past uh, Ag Farm, going down this one. Uh, nice to have a bit of downhill, have a bit of a rest. Though you have to keep the wits about you uh, with this slippery, slippery and slidey mud. This is all packed gravel, but a lot of mud's been. Uh, uh, swilled onto it. Swill. <laughs> well, there's when you get all these downhills, you know there's a bloody uphill coming. It takes five seconds to go down and then three hours to get up and bloody. Down. Yeah, so it's a public private way, that's where I've just come down. Lockerbrook Farm. Woodcraft folk, one mile. Well, I don't know about that, but I uh, can't even remember seeing a farm actually, but hey ho. farm I've just come through is Rowley Farm, Rowley Farm. I don't really can see that Rowley Farm. This is the A57 Snake Pass. Very fast road, you have to be very careful. So can we see? Yeah. So I'm going to be going up there in a minute or two. Just get down here. And getting up that hill it's this is a lot of a hiker biker thing, you can't pedal up it. Well, I put on it fair. Now, when you're in valley, you're soon out at sun. It's the time of the year, we're almost on the longest day. So, uh, yeah, so we're almost longest day, so the sun's really low in the sky, even during the day, not at noon. Oh, well, there's a few cars parked down here. It is a Thursday, uh, I'm off work, annual leave. Um, make wet feet. <laughs> Chaps. <laughs> oh, good luck with that. Yeah, no, I think I'm walking most <laughs> of the way up here. <laughs> Oh yeah, they, they have been there. I kept going on, it turned you to uh, Alport Castle. We're heading up Blackley Lay, Black, Blackley Hay, even. Yeah, I've come up here before, most of it's walking, but where the water's streaming through, it creates quite clean stones. Right, and that's me. Ooh. Snake. Oh. As you can see, just come down there into Snake Pass. Uh, Blackley Hay, cross, Blackley Hay, that's where I am. Uh, Hag Farm, crossroads, just up there, on the hill there, heading up here. 
think it's Hope Cross I'm heading towards. I'm glad when I can get back on bike. I might reward myself with a drink once I peak the summit here. Ah, that's a good uh, example there. All right, so those two hills, that's the Crook, Crook Hill, Wynn Hill, Bamford Ridge and Stanage Edge. I've just come across there. Uh, yeah, and come down there. So I'm on a bit of flat now, thank God. Get cycling again. It's a bit difficult to cycling between these ruts because your pedals to catch the sides. You have to be careful, very difficult. So uh, just trudging up that hill where I had to walk. I was sheltered from the wind. Now, now I've come over hill, I feel it freezing cold wind again. It's about seven degrees. Still a long way to go yet though. How far have I gone? So we've done 10 kilometers. Feels a lot further because we're all uh, slow going. Um, yeah, no, still a fair way to go yet. Looks as if it's uh, getting a bit uh, rainified over there anyway. Looks okay that way. I hope it's not. I want to be going in that direction, but I think I'm going in that direction. This is not looking good. It's Mam Tor and Lucille. Win Hill there. Uh, yeah, oh, rain. didn't forecast any rain. Well, not in Chesterfield anyway. Right. Obviously, you can keep going down there. Take you to Lucille and. Uh, I might take you down into New Bamford or down into Castleton or Oak. Uh, see where we're going here. It says Pulley Footpath. Oh, Bridal Way, Edale. So, yeah. So, I'm coming down here, but I will be going up somewhere along there. To, along that ridge, then dropping down to uh, Hope. But going on to Edale at the moment. So I've been complaining about the hills being super steep going up them. Sometimes it can be quite bad going down. This is super, <laughs> super steep. Ow. <laughs> I've got a record of being uh, over the bars, OTB. So I'm taking it easy. <laughs> so, where are we at? Jagger's Cloth. Cloth. Jagger's Cloth. Yeah. So, I know it's quite a steep climb up here as well. Well, steep climb coming down, obviously, it's going to be a steep climb bloody going up, isn't it? So, this is uh, just what, 50 metres on? It's not the steepness, it's all loose gravel. If I try and cycle, my back wheel just spins. Although, it is quite steep. So, I might be able to do this. Once again, I ain't got low enough gears. Or I ain't got the power for the gears I've got, I should just say. Okay, okay, it's a bit breezy here, so. But uh, just got to that really steep section. Uh, I'm only down into the valley where Edale is. You can see the train line. If anyone wants to come up here, it's quite easy by train uh, with your bike. Um, so 
So yeah, I'll go down in Teedale, get onto the road for a little while, stop. Then I get up onto the ridge, onto the edge at cliffs there. Cliffs, <laughs> what if you call it? Hills. On the peak of the hills, shall we say. Uh, in fact, you can see the road from here, can't you? So there we go. Um, uh, switch it back on when I'm back down at road. I've got to save my battery, the memory, yada yada yada. Switch it off. So I've just uh, come off the hills there. Down to, uh, well, road to Edale. Don't know the name of it. Now, I'm going to pedal along. Uh, this road for a while um, at least it's nice and easy on a flat smooth road now wow well, look how dark it looks yeah I hope it doesn't rain so this is Edale we could park here to get up onto Kinder Scout there a track about half a mile up a turning way. Um, yeah. Yeah. 